to our high school student council's special election show for 2020. During this show, we will be getting to know our candidates and why would you want to vote for them. And we'll have a little fun along the way. I'm Mark McGinley at CHS. Get ready to vote. Voting will take place will take place September 14th and 17th, and you'll be able to receive a ballot by email to cast your vote. Hey, Mark. What's your favorite animal? I'd say a panda. What about you, Takesia? I love giraffes. But enough about us, Mark. Let's go to the candidates. Hello, everyone. Why don't you introduce yourselves by telling us your name, your grade, and what office you'll be running for? Oh, and also tell us your favorite animal. Hi, my name is Ricky Harris, and I will be running for president. My favorite animal is a deer. Hi there, I'm Lexi Sindal, and I'm running for student council president, and my favorite animal is a unicorn. Hi, I'm Isabel Baker. I'm running for vice president, and my favorite animal is a turtle. Hey guys, my name is Gracie Maples, and I'm running for vice president, and my favorite animal would have to be a flamingo. Hello, my name is Oriana, and I'll be running for cemetery, and my favorite animal is a wolf. Hi there, I'm Addison Tizio. I'm running for student council secretary, and my favorite animal is a cheetah. Hey Choctaw, my name is Sunny Tabor. I'm running for treasurer, and my favorite animal is an orangutan. Thanks everybody, great job. But let's get some of the real issues our, our voters want to know about. Let's start with our candidates for president and vice president. Tell us, what is your top goal for, your, for our school if you are elected? This year, if I am elected, I want to make this year a fun and safe year for everyone on campus. I also want to make sure everyone on campus is included and know about all of our events that goes on here at Tata High School. My most important goal this year is to make every single student who walks through the doors of Choctaw High School every day feel like their voice matters. Because your voice does matter, every single member of our student body is just as important as the other. And so my main goal is to make you feel special. Hi, I think my main goal for everyone would be positivity. Uh, I really, really want everyone to have a great year, including the circumstances. It's great to be hopeful and to have a good outlook, even if the year is crazy. As vice president, my main goal is to make sure everyone's included. And I believe everyone's ideas and thoughts should be set out on the table for everyone to hear. Secretary and treasurer candidates, what is a key task of the office you are going for? And why would you be good at that job? Well, first of all, I want, I want to make, I want to everyone feel that they're included and important to me. So, and I want everyone to feel um, welcomed and included, especially to the new students. Um, I feel like I want to help the vice president and president to do their jobs successfully. One of the main jobs of my office as treasurer is to fundraise. Um, fundraising is a very important task for me um, because fundraising allows us to do everything that we do in student council from activities to helping students. And so if I can help them raise the funds that we need, um, our student council can be successful in everything that we do. And I like all these candidates. Let's line up this. Let's line this up a little bit, guys. Tell us who your favorite SpongeBob character is. My favorite Spongebob character would have to be Patrick because not only do I look like him, but sometimes I act like him too. But it's fun. That's just part of me. My favorite Spongebob character is Spongebob himself because, you know, he's the main character. Me too. I like Spongebob too because he's very cheerful and very joyful like I am. And he always makes me smile like I do to everyone else. My very favorite Spongebob character would have to be Gary because he's very easygoing. I would also have to say my favorite character is Gary. Um, I love every single line delivery. So intricate. Wow. <laughs> my favorite SpongeBob character would definitely be Mr. Krabs because he just makes me laugh. And yeah, I don't watch SpongeBob. <laughs> you can't go wrong with SpongeBob. Thanks, candidates. Here's your next question. What leadership experience do you have that has prepared you for the office you are running for? Well, the last Four years I've been in student council since I was a freshman and I've been secretary my sophomore year, vice president my junior year, and now I'm running for president. 
I'm a new member to Student Council, but I'm so grateful for the opportunity that I've been able to run our Valentine's Day fundraiser last year. I got to run two Gold Rush projects, and I also was a really big part of our freshman preview. I was a member of the YLX Leadership Skills class last year, which was a really great experience that helped prepare me in diverse leadership. And also, I've been an officer for our SASTA Drama Club, and being involved in theater has taught me a lot of great things about teamwork. Hi guys, uh, I would say my leadership experience is primarily in student council, but I also have some outside experience. Last year I ran the Walk with a Purpose. That was a huge and great turnout to spend money, to raise money for the Tri-City Youth Center. I have also been in the Oklahoma Teen Board. This is a group of students that get together to talk about leadership skills and all great things like that. Hey guys, my leadership experience would have to be, I've been in student council since my freshman year and I've learned a lot from all the officers throughout the years. I've worked on pep rallies, homecoming, dress up days, football games, and everything in between. I'm a new member to student council too because last year during my freshman year I've been a student council representative and I've been trying to help out the student council the best way I can. I've been in student council my whole life as long as I can remember, but my main thing is I've done cheer, and cheer is a part of a team and helping a team build a team and be a leader, so I feel like that qualifies me as a leader. I've been in student council since seventh grade, and I've absolutely fell in love with it. Eighth grade, I served as our student council president. Ninth grade, I served as our ninth grade class president. Um, I've been in leadership since I've been in high school. I was a recipient of the National Junior Honor Society Outstanding Member Award, um, where I dedicated 300 hours of community service. I am so dedicated to serving my school and my community, and that's what qualifies me as a candidate for student council leadership. Let's conclude our show with a chance for you for you to speak directly to voters. What do you feel is the most important thing for voters to know about you as a candidate for your office? The most important thing for voters to know about me is that I am a people person. I love all people and I want everyone to feel welcome in our school, in our community, and especially in our student council. I want them to know that they can come and talk to me if they have issues and I want them to know that we will resolve their issues for them because that is our purpose of being here. I want voters to know about me as I'm very compassionate and empathetic. I love people. I want to help everyone that I can. I want to listen to everyone and make sure I get their problems fixed. Like they said before, I'm very outgoing. I'm, very, I'm a very social person. I would love to help out other people the best way I can and achieve their goals. What I want my voters to know about me is I'm all about inclusion and having fun. I want everyone to know about all the programs and sports going around and everything to do with them and just to have fun. What I want the voters to know about me is that even though high school can be scary and mentally draining, I'm a very positive and outgoing person that want nothing more for you to have a great school year. I'm all about positivity and sharing kindness among others. My most important goal this year is to lead with vision, dedication, so we can have a year of excellence. Hi, I am a people person I love everyone here at Tata High School. I want the best for you. So, that being said, vote me for president, Ricky Harris. Wow, I don't know about you, Takesia, but I'm going to have to really think about these great choices to lead our school. Where can voters get more information about voting and the candidates? Well, Mark, follow Stuco's Instagram account at ChoctawHSStuco and our Twitter account also at ChoctawHSStuco for videos, info, and updates on all things election related. Well, that does it for our election show. Thank you, Mark, for being a great co-host. And to all the candidates, thank you and good luck. Remember, Jackets, vote on September the 14th or the 17th. We will see you at the vote.